Yeah, good morning again, Dia. Right now I'm joined by Rob Perry, the city administrator, waking up early with us this morning. Rob, just telling me uh, you actually uh, went to school with a lot of people in the news business and everything, so this is nothing new for you. You've probably done this a lot, and you kind of understand how this works and everything. A little bit, a little yeah. bit, yeah. Uh, this weather not indicative of what we should usually expect in Bradenton, is that fair to say? Y yeah, well, I love it personally. It's a pleasant change, but okay. sure. All right, that makes one of us out here. Uh, <laughs> look, I just want to tell you, you know, I came across the bridge this morning, and we're right off First Avenue yeah. here. Uh, it just looks beautiful. It uh, is, it, it, it really was very nice, and you want to talk about the growth this area has experienced and all the work you guys have done. we got some video of the Riverwalk we can pop up here and talk about, too. Perfect, absolutely, yeah. Uh, the Riverwalk, Main Street, um, all kinds of different uh, improvements we've been bringing down here. Uh, it's the new Bradenton. That's the good news, and just people love it. And, you know, one of the things that it seems to really appeal to people are these parks and these trails and the, the ways that you can come out here and really experience nature and see things. We're talking about giving people an excuse to, to kind of come down south from Tampa. A lot of our viewers, Tampa, St. Pete, everything right. else. Uh, and as we show you the, the beautiful river walk here, uh, lots of great things to do. Take your family and it won't cost you too much, will it? No, it, it, it's free. It brings you to nature. It's beautiful. You enjoy the outdoors. We got rec pads. We have splash pads. We have uh, we have different types of amenities all along the river walk. We've expanded to three miles now. It's one of the largest ones in, this, in, in the area. Yeah, taking a look at it here from an overhead view, we had uh, our, our ABC Action News drone get some really good footage here as, as we're showing you here on the monitor. And uh, it, it's really impressive. And what have you seen as a result of getting this thing finished? What has the response been like? What's interesting is there's been a lot of interest in development all along the Riverwalk um, with the uh, potential for redevelopment. We're only 14.4 square miles here, and so we have to basically knock things down and build them back better, and, and they're just terrific these days. We have a lot of people that are interested in bringing businesses, jobs, and other types of uh, forward-looking opportunities. So a lot of people moving here. Um, we're dealing with the associated growth issues, but it's it's a great, great place. Something we talk about so often here on the show is the growth our area is experiencing, and your area is no different. Can you give us a peek into the future? Something we can look forward to. You're working on? Yeah, yeah. We got um, uh, we got some major projects going on. Um, potential sale of City Hall, which would be a city center, something uh, akin to uh, uh, probably more a uh, hotel. Um, food, beverage, entertainment, activities, and uh, we want a place downtown. That's our superpower here, is the downtown Riverwalk area. And we want to capitalize on that. We want visitors, we want people that are from here to come down and to engage and, and enjoy Bradenton. Rob Perry, City Administrator, giving us the hard sell this morning on right. Bradenton. Thanks for getting up early with you.